I'm so sorry. Hi. <laughs> Do you know sloth is my favorite animal? Is it really? Yes, it it's is. It's a lot of people's favorite animals. Right now, sloths seem to be very popular. But this little guy. He's so cute. He, he doesn't even have a name yet. He don't. He doesn't have a name yet. He, um, he was nursing with his mom, but she wasn't producing enough milk. Mm -hmm. And so he started to get a little dehydrated, and eventually the mom kind of rejected him, so he had to be hand-reared. And so this stuffed animal sloth is his surrogate mom. Do you see him? I, yeah. Listen, do you I wanna, had. Do you want to pet him? I, I want to pet him. I want to take him. Can I be your mama? <laughs> oh, you are so precious. Here, you know what? He's, Can, he's starting to eat a little bit of eat. solid food. Let's see if he wants some lettuce. Okay. Now, Try do he lettuce. got a long tongue or something? What no, he got? just hold it up there. Okay. Let's see if he wants you some. Don't want he blood? might not. He might not. Mama Hood to feed you. You want some? You're so sweet. Aren't they neat? How yeah. old is he? He's just five months old. You're, you're five yeah, months? Yeah, he's five months old. And sloths, two-toed sloths, are found in Central and South America. Okay. And they live in the trees. They spend their whole life upside down, basically. They hang. So this isn't the position he'll be in as an adult. Mm -hmm. He'll be hanging like this as an adult from branches. That's even more precious. But right now, since he's such a baby, he would be, he's holding on to his his stuffed animal, it would be his mom in a normal situation. Can I be your mom? Come on, baby, eat something for me. Come on, let's sit down. Sit down on the good, you want a blanket? Here, <laughs> yeah. you want, oh, you're so sweet. So he ain't gonna move, huh? Does he make no. a sound? He makes some, a little quiet sounds, Where but not going? a Where lot. Where you going, you, you wanna come they over? They should really be called the two-fingered sloths. Baby, your meals is longer fingers. than mine. Yeah. He wants, what, can, what's his, he doesn't have a name yet? He doesn't have a name yet. Can Any I suggestions? Oh, absolutely. Oh my God, see, I'm your mama. Hold back. <laughs> can I kiss him? You can kiss him. <laughs> McCavity, don't be jealous. <laughs> oh my God, I got me a new baby. Okay, so I done took your whole and Let's see, oh. let me try to feed him again. Here. <laughs> oh, now I want to name him. What you, what you think? Hudson. It's a boy, right? Hudson. I think it should be Hudson. Let's see, Hudson? Yeah, it's a boy. It's a Hudson. boy. Can I call you Hudson? You know, You're not getting this baby back. <laughs> we got a slop now. Here we go. Is that my friend? This, yes, this is your old friend. Oh my God. And last time, if you recall, he didn't have a name and one of your audience members uh -huh. had suggested Hudson. Y'all hear that? So I think we're gonna go with Hudson. You're gonna go with Hudson? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love that. How old is yeah. Hudson? Now? Look, you see he loves me. You he's see this? About se he's about seven months now. He's bigger than last time, he right? He is bigger. He's grown a lot. What you been doing, Hudson? And he, so sloths, Look how they he move is. around by hanging upside down. They basically spend their whole life upside down. And so he's, he's for him, walking now. He's hanging. He can move around and, and um, travel on his own, just limb yeah. over limb, hanging from, from I perches. I want to see some of your tricks. So he's developed a lot since we were last here. Hi, Hudson. And let's see. Yeah, he might want... Sometimes if he doesn't like the brown or red leaves, he'll I go didn't for, season it right. You know I don't cook go well. For the green. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look how, you see how cute he is. Yeah, and he will continue to grow until he's a couple years old. A couple years yeah. old. Yeah. Okay, now he, Hudson gonna sit here with me, but what else you got next? Well, we brought a surprise. We brought uh -oh. Hudson's father. You brought his daddy. Yeah, and so you could see how how big he's gonna eventually get. Let's see, here he is. Hudson is really... Now this is Sid's. Bigger than you thought? Yeah. Yeah, they get big. They get big. They move real slow though, right? Yeah, they move pretty slow. Oh, and this is my how God. They... So Hudson this is gonna how get they that... Live. Dad ain't got to get that close. He lives... Um... <laughs> he ain't got to get that close. This is how they move around. They hang. They live upside down. So you can feed him if you want. You want to feed him? No, you can feed him and I'll, I'll feed, feed him. <laughs> no, I'll no, feed no. him and then you feed him. Okay. Here, let's see. There he goes. What he eating? He's eating zucchini. They're mostly her herbivorous. So they mostly eat plants, but they'll eat some bird's eggs sometimes or even um, insects occasionally. Does he go after it? Like, how no, does he's he being, eat? Well, here. Does he hunt? <laughs> uh, he they forage. They, they roam around in the trees looking for leaves and... Flowers and fruits. There he goes. He, 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 he wanted the pear. So they instead. just be chilling. Here, come feed him. Okay, Hudson, let's Here. go. You can take him with you. I'm coming. You let's go him. see about your daddy. Come on. <laughs> I got you, baby. Right. Oh my God, you are so cute. Hold yeah. the line. Okay, okay, here you go. Yeah. Now, will Hudson want some too? Or? Yeah, they're okay. 
They're okay together. I don't, I don't know just about that. I'm him. sorry. Yeah, he'll just take it from you. Ooh, yeah, but how? Just hold it right up to his mouth. He'll do all the work. You just have to put it right there. There we go. He's Ooh. not going to hurt you. Now, Sid and Hudson are two-toed sloths. Okay. There are two main groups of sloths. There's you the three-toed and the two-toed. They actually should be called the two-fingered sloths because it's the, the forelimbs where they have the, the two um, <laughs> claws. But yeah, he's eating slow. He They're slow. Guess. He's taking his time. <laughs> there we go. Oh, you go, is now he you grabbing see, it? Yeah, he's grabbing it. You can see there the two claws. Your nails Make is longer a, than mine. Look at a this. two-fingered sloth. There he goes. You better chill. Yeah. Get your best life. They're in no rush to do anything. You want now, to do another one? Does he have other children? No, this is his first offspring. He got, he's living <laughs> his best life. Okay, <laughs> thank you so much, thank oh, you you're so here. welcome. You're, you're amazing. So welcome. Okay. What in the world? <laughs> All right. This is, this is Where Alan. Is this Who? is Alan, and here, I want you to feed him. What is Alan? Alan is a porcupine, and he's, he's looking for a snack. He, want, he's, he wants you to feed him. That's a carrot. They're herbivores, so they only Wait, eat plants. Of course, in the wild, they wouldn't eat carrots. You're They'd eat cute. leaves and even bark. You ain't gonna but bite you me, just though. hand it to him, and he'll Ooh, pick it up. Oh, Jesus. Okay, you hey. got a whole arm. Yeah. yeah. Isn't can, he awesome? You are, you are cute. Can I, can I touch him? Okay, so porcupines are covered with quills. In fact, he has about 30,000 quills. He doesn't have them on his belly, so that's why um, we're able to pick him up. He's but if you go with the grain... That's okay. I, I don't need to. that way. <laughs> then you won't get quilt. You got to have some stopping sense to think for yourself, yeah, okay? Yeah. <laughs> now, I, I have kind of a sweet story about Alan. Um, Betty White was one of our biggest supporters. Aw. And we had two, two little porcupines. We named one Betty, and we asked Betty if she'd like to name the other one. And she decided to name him Alan after her late husband, Alan. Aw, that's so sweet. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. Alan's hungry. Here, you want So he, he <laughs> likes carrots and... He likes, he likes carrots, yeah. And what else he likes? In the wild, they would eat leaves and berries and, and bark. In the winter, they live off a lot of bark because the leaves fall off of the trees. You better choose. And we have bar porcupines in, uh, in California mm -hmm. in the Sierra Nevada mountain range, but they're declining. And it's not clear why. So their, their numbers are declining like so much wildlife. So we're part of an effort to maintain a, a zoological population of a species as a safeguard to extinction. So we have had babies at Wildlife Learning Center. And so we're helping to maintain, you know, a, a genetically diverse population of animals. And in some cases, these programs have been able to release them back out into the wild. Like the California condor is a success story. We're involved with that with the sloths mm -hmm. and the porcupines and, Eat them, sit down. and a couple other species. Yeah, let's turn him before the... I just got poked. Wow, <laughs> so these are really yeah. poke you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They're sharp. Now, these, these are called guard hairs here, but the quills are underneath. See that? And is this mm. to protect them? Don't oh, you yeah. fall off of here. Oh, he's okay. Oh, David. Is that like a wolf or a fox? This is a wolf. No, this is a wolf, and his name is Klondike. Beautiful animal. He is, is beautiful. Yeah. yeah but he, that's a wolf. Now, this, the, the, he has an amazing story. He was actually found in the street. So In some, the street? Someone had him as a pet, and they do not make good pets. So he was sent to um, a wolf rescue and uh, was, was raised by people. But this what? is Klondike. Hyundai. Yeah, oh my God, a spectacular beautiful. animal. And wildlife lovers in California are extremely excited about wolves right now because they were exterminated from the state in the 1920s, but they're making a comeback all on their own. And they have started moving into California from Oregon, and we now have three packs of wolves he in Northern so California. Beautiful. So they're making a return. And <laughs> if you love wildlife like I do, it's, it's really exciting. I do. I'm, I cannot believe I cannot rub them. Well, he's... No, oh, he, no, don't no, well, me. You ain't got to be, tell me twice. <laughs> wolves can be skittish and shy. He's very comfortable right now, but they can be very cautious. How do you know is he's it, comfortable? Because he is exploring his area. He's looking around. His ears are upright. He's sniffing. He's, he's very comfortable It feels right like now. a dog. Yeah, they're related, yeah. Okay. Yeah, they're closely related. So do they get bigger than dogs? Like... Uh, yeah, he's, a, he's about 85 pounds. 
And that. some male wolves can get bigger than this, so some are, are, are much bigger. Don't wolves like run in packs, though? Yeah, they will form their own packs. Young males will disperse from, their, from the litter when they're about a year or two old, and then they might be solitary for a while, but then they'll establish their own pack at some point. So but they generally are found in Did in you pack. say how old he was? Yes. Yeah. He is, he's about nine years old now. Y'all better look yeah. out. He looked yeah. at y'all over there. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, right. Who else do you have today? For well, you? we have a really another exciting animal for you. All right, we're going to say goodbye to Claude. No. All right, thank you. Man, I, I cannot right. believe I was that close to a wolf. <laughs> he got a little startled by this guy. So he, he got, what you mean he got? He got, he got a little startled <laughs> by. That is the thing. Woo! Father God! Uh uh! You done lost your host! <laughs> nope! I'm coming over here with you. James, should I hold me? Uh, Sometimes you can have sis for yourself, okay? Jennifer. Uh, yes, yeah, so Jennifer, now this is okay. one that you could touch. I hear you, you over here, David. One. You can pet this one. Oh, this, Father! This Woo. is Mr. T. Oh, God. Trust me. What did I get myself? He's a good boy. He's a really good boy. In fact, you can help me feed him. Help you feed him? Yeah. You can help <laughs> him. Oh, my God. He's come around this way. I am. I'm going to love you so much. Do you see his tail? Yes. He's got a nice long tail. Here, pat him on the, pat him on the back right there. Look it. It's... Father, that thing look quick. No, he's not, he's not going to hurt you. Here, just touch me. He's just a little bit bumpy and scaly, that's all. <laughs> These are this is one of the largest species of lizards in the world. These are fascinating animals. I cannot do they're this. They're called water, water monitors because they're usually found uh, close to a water source. Okay. Go on. The audience would be very proud of you. Y'all gonna be proud of me. <laughs> one question, would you touch it? Well, why don't you invite, invite an audience member down Okay, to will somebody her? help me touch it? <laughs> I'm really scared. I ain't playing with y'all. Oh, okay. Oh, you're not scared? Okay, well, you go first. <laughs> but your, your job is to, ultimately, we want her to touch it. Okay. Hi, how are you? Do go you ahead see and... Look at you. Yeah. He's a good boy. Let's do it together. <laughs> Come okay, on, let's do it she said, let's do it together. See, we are a family, y'all. <laughs> okay? Come on. You gonna touch them? Yeah, yeah everybody. There you go. Oh. There, yeah, there you go. <laughs> because of y'all, okay. Yes. Yes. That thing scared me to death. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch four episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.